Speedway Worldwide Wrestling, 837 9674. Bullies. Brother Ernest Angel and Brother Ernest, what's the good book say on this matchup between Air Paris Wee! and Elix Skipper? Get back, friends. Those of you at home, touch the TV set and feel the action of this jam up, pack up, foot washing, Holy Ghost match. Brother Ernest, I don't know, are you taking up a donation today or? If they want to send them, Brother Jack, I'll sure take them. Johnson, you know relation to those people in the ice cream business? I know the Band-Aid business, so we oh, have Oh, well, a, I didn't know you look like you eat a little ice cream, so I'm, I'm heir to a Band-Aid portion. We've got air skippers going at it right now. Both men just filling each other out at the start of this match. That Air Paris, you know, you just see, can feel the spirit that that boy has. You can watch him work, and you know that he's a winner. Skipper, either a master of Taekwondo, or he just got done watching Karate Kid 2 going through the uh, basic forms right there, although uh, he's not hitting anybody with those kicks. Well, he, it's so boring that Air Paris has got to sit down and wait on him. Air Paris, not a master nor fan of the martial arts, as Eric Hicks, the referee, is trying to get both guys together and get some action here, Brother Ernest. This is uh, looks like a, uh, a slow day at church or something. Well, I can certainly see Air. Now, you can see he's going over there and concentrate uh, there with... Brother Bert Prentice, what a fine man. I thought, he, know, was, I thought he was lost at one time. Oh, oh, no, my friend. Brother Prentice is probably one of the finest, finest minds in wrestling today. I asked him to wash my feet one time to show him and then he just, he just turned away. Although I had been out in the mud for a while. short on your ties, brother. <laughs> Both men still in the ring. Talking you can to just the, tell the fans, the fans there, they love air power. You can just see them talking with him. They're waving their fingers and their hands at him. Eric Paris, a big Tennessee oh. volunteer fan, as you can see with the orange shirt. Maybe uh, Elix Skipper is a, is a Vanderbilt fan or something. We don't know. There's certainly not any gold there. I see the black. Paris with the blows to the body of Skipper. Another blow to the head. Skipper not looking too good right now, brother. Maybe you can save him. Ah, Irish now. football. Oh, Skipper went up and it looked like he. Uh, my money's on the Paris boy. I, of course, I'm not a betting man. Looked like he ran up the ropes and ran out of steam there. The reversal. Uh oh, look out. Up and over. Air Paris. Oh, oh Savant kick and that. he rolls out, out to the outside mm. of the ring. Air Paris. Flat on his back. Well, you can see he's going. Brother Bert's going to get over and take care of him. Bring him back to life, Bert. You know, I don't know, brother, if you heard about the new uh, movie, Barry Blaustein came out, Beyond the Math. They've got one about Bird Prentice coming out. It's a sequel to that. It's called uh, Beyond the Fact. Oh! <laughs> you remind me of a story, too, I'll have to tell you later on, Brother Johnson. Uh, there were two potatoes that got married. There was an <laughs> Irish potato and a sweet potato, and they got married. And uh, they had a little daughter. No, it's an Irish potato. I'll, I'll try to remember Couldn't have been that. in Tennessee. I don't no, think that's legal. No, it's not. Air Paris and Elix Skipper, you're watching NWA Worldwide. Both men starting off slow, not wanting to wear themselves out early on, but you're talking about two great athletes right here. Absolutely, and that Air Paris, I want you to watch it. He, every move, is with strategy and methodical. Both men lock up, collar and elbow. And now a, it looks like a hammerlock into a uh, takedown as uh, Skipper rolls him up, coming with the uh, front face lock. As Air Ooh. Paris is working his way towards the towards the ring apron, towards the rope, he's trying to get some where he's going, some direction now. Maybe he's looking for some help from the fans, maybe looking for that power. Brother, he's got it. You just wait and see. Skipper's going to take his ship back to sea. You're watching NWA Worldwide fans once again. Some of the best wrestling action you will see in Middle Tennessee, all across the state. The old NWA style, Matt Wrestling, some great action, some great men, some great young men here locking up again, collar and elbow. Full arm drag and twist by Skipper. Skipper working on the wrist of Air Paris. Come on, brother. Into the arm bar and looks like, uh, looks like Skipper with the upper hand right now. Going to work him over slowly. Try to keep him from going to those ring ropes. He's trying to get to the ropes to break the hole. Maybe he gets the, try to get the leg up there. Didn't Paris do him any good, though, did he? Paris got the leg on the rope just to break the hold. It seems he's just going in a little uh, defensive mode now, trying to break holds, trying to get to the rim side, trying to break it up. 
Tell you what, fans, we got to go pay some bills right now. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Tonight, 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 live NWA wrestling at the Columbia Grand Slam USA. Kids, get in for free. Bell time, 7.30 p.m. In the main event, a triple threat tag team match. New South takes on the Wild Boys and Mephisto and Dante. In the opening bout, Gypsy Joe meets a mystery opponent. Wildcat Chris Harris takes on that dancing fool styling Shane Eaton. The Boogie Woogie Boy goes head to head with the crippler Jeff Daniels. That's tonight at the Columbia Grand Slam USA. Bell time, 7.30 p.m. Kids, get in for free the main event, a triple threat tag team match with the New South, Ashley Hudson, Corey Williams versus the Wild Boys taking on Mephisto and Dante. That's tonight at the Columbia Grand Slam USA. Bell time, 7.30 p.m. Kids, get in for free. That's tonight at the Columbia Grand Slam USA. Be there. Manpower is currently recruiting direct hires for a major distribution warehouse with immediate openings for warehouse associates in their new facility. Second and third shifts are available. For more information, call Manpower at 885-0555. We're back ringside with NWA Worldwide. Jack Johnson along with Brother Ernest and Brother. We've got, uh, we see uh, Elix Skipper there with a nice bridge. Uh, you, you bridge me like that, and I've got to go to chiropractor for about a month. Well, I'll tell you what. They, Air Paris is letting him have his way right now, but it ain't over yet till the fat lady sings. And she's not even up there with her choir robe on yet. Air Paris and Elix Skipper, we're watching them in the ring right now. Been a pretty even matchup so far. Skipper getting the best of uh, the multi-pierced Air Paris right now. We saw him in an interview earlier in the program with Bert Prentice. He's a very outspoken young man. I don't know about those piercings. Didn't the eyebrow brother and all that, is that even a... Is, it, is that something a man should do? To that's freedom like that? of speech, my friend, and that's what we found in this country on, is freedom of speech, to be able to talk about anything and do anything. And that's that man's body. I just never saw, oh, a swinging neck breaker. I never oh, saw oh, oh, George Washington with a, with a nose ring or anything like that. I just think it's something a little unusual, but if... How many cherry trees you chopped down, Brother Johnson? I've never told a lie, I can well, tell you I that. Oh, feel the spirit. I don't know about that. Air Paris hurls Elix Skipper outside the ring where he needs to be. You know, you remind me of a story. There was an Irish potato and a new potato, and they got married. They had a little child named Sweet Potato. Sweet Potato came home from college, and she said, Oh, Mother, I've met the best man in the world at college. I want to get married. She said, Well, I'll ask you, Daddy Irish. You come home next weekend, and I'll tell you. Little Sweet Potato run home. She said, Oh, Mama, Mama, what did Daddy Irish say? She said, Well, he wants to know his name. He says, Tom Brokaw. She says, Well, you come back next week, and I'll tell you. Come back the next week. She said, well, what did Daddy say? She said, honey, no way you're going to marry Sweet Potato. Sweet Potato's going to marry Tom Brokaw. He ain't nothing but an old commentator. And that kind of reminds me of you, Brother Johnson, just an old commentator. <laughs> Thank you, sir. We saw Bert Prentice on the outside of the ring dealing some potatoes of his own to Elix Skipper. He's back in the ring now with Air Paris. And well, it rolls him out again. Why well, he's rolled him out, of course, uh, whether it's, I guess it's joke time or something. I don't, I don't know if you know, but Madonna's getting married again. Oh, really? She's going to name the kid after uh, the father, and uh, I think uh, Miami Dolphins is a cute name. <laughs> yes, that's just the she's pleased many, I guess. Prentice rolls Skipper back on the inside. Trying to get him back in there so he, Air Paris, can win this match. Look out, Air Paris. Oh, up there we go. How about that? My, my, my. You can tell the strategic move of Air Paris. Referee Eric Hicks with a 10 count. Both men have to get back in soon. Those uh, moves are, are great, but you got to get back in before the count don't rolls you out. Know, don't you know those people at home right now are missing that action? Don't you know that they would like to be there? It reminds me of many times in the congregation where people miss out. And that's what they're doing, is missing out by not being at one of these fine NWA matches. And we've got some great ones to tell them about later on, don't we, Brother Johnson? We sure do, brother. Uh, <laughs> I missed your sermon on Sunday, but I'm glad to be here with you right now. I can feel the power. Amen, and I'm, I'm glad I'm sorry you did. By the way, the offering plate was a little short. You need to come on up with your tie. I'll, I'll have to dig deep. Amen. Oh, look at Bert Prentice. What's he doing? It's, uh, he's checking that skipper out to see if he's all right to wrestle. He's, he's doing a little physical, little physical therapy on him, little, checking on him. Laying of hands on the outside. I didn't know Prentice was a charismatic, but I guess, you know, perhaps he's... He is quite animated there at ringside. Brother Prentice is a 
right there in his corner. See, he's telling that referee that's where I be. European uppercut by Skipper to Air Paris. Now the uh, roll-up, he's got him pinned. Whoa, 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 where's that referee Eric Hicks distracted on the outside by Bert Prentice. Prentice with some antics of his own out there. That's uh, Hicks, a veteran referee, shouldn't be that distracted. Oh, they're going out the ring. Again. And that man can't stay in the ring, Brother Johnson. What's the problem? You do have to be in the ring to make the pin. Skipper, uh, look out, Bert Prentice once again putting the boots to him. Bert's checking him. Putting the schools to him on the outside. Making sure he's all right. Trying to get him up the way and roll a little bit. There goes Air to check on him a little bit. Ferris rolls out the ring. So we've got lots of action outside putting the ring in this in. match. Both men back in on the mat. I don't believe that Skipper boy knows where he wants to be, does he? I think he wants to be back in the locker room with a, with a clean one. Snapmare takeover by With a Ferris. bowl of collard greens. <laughs> I'm not even... <laughs> Brother Ernest, that, uh, oh my. Look out here, Paris going up top. He's going up top. Whoa, oh, look oh. out. I think something like that could just snap your neck. You've got to be quite, a, quite an athlete there. With a cover, one, two, oh, and the kick out. By Skipper, he's still alive. Well, I think we're fixing to see the final move. I feel it coming. Paris shoots Skipper off the ropes. Look out. Oh my. With a cover, one, two, and no, he kicks out again. He's still got life. He still believes, brother, and you know I how to I understand that, but he needs to put his hand in the air and say, I'm coming home. That's all I can tell you. Got the reverse chin lock on uh, Skipper. Air Paris on the top there. That looks like he just got done playing pickup basketball or something. I don't know about his choice of ring attire. I guess it's just pretty colorful, though, but uh, Perhaps uh, with a couple more wins. Well, you're a star. You can wear anything, anytime, any place, kind of and the public loves you. You can hear that public right there around the ring. Oh, my. Talking to him, speaking to him, and it's wonderful, the thoughts that they have, I'm sure. Both men going at it still look like a uh, kind of a, a skipper had a kind of a wheelbarrow on uh, Paris, and then uh, into the back body drop. Some of those moves you dish out can also take their toll on you as the uh, rest are dishing them out. And anytime you go in with a tough move like that, uh, you're bound to wind up worse for wear. Those people are wanting this match to be over, aren't they, Brother Johnson? They're hollering, go, Skipper, go where they want him to go. They want him to go. <laughs> I guess I Maybe they won't go back to church. Both men locked up. Look out. What? That's quite a, that, that young man is very flexible, Skipper is. He's... Uh, one of the better athletes here in NWA, although when I say one of the better athletes, I don't mean to slight anyone. They're all great athletes. Oh, oh, oh. How about that? How oh. about that? That's what I'm talking about, Brother Johnson. That strategic move that Air Pass has learned, he's learned it under the auspices of Brother Prentice. I know Bert, he teaches that boy some of the fine, and I don't mean boy, I don't mean it that way, but he teaches that young man some of the finest moves. It takes a good manager to make a good wrestler. I think that hurts his attendance of family planning after that uh, blow to the uh, groin there. And now Air Paris setting him up on top of the ropes, up in the ring corner. He's climbing up top. What is he going for? A, maybe a superplex or something? Look out. Skipper's still in the daze. He doesn't know where he's at. Rice to the head. Oh, he's fighting back now. He's fighting back. And whoa, that goes Air Paris. Air Paris. And Skipper. Look out, big drop kick from the top. He's still standing now with the cover. One, two, three, and he pinned the new winner. Elix, Skipper, and brother, that was quite a comeback. He well, kept I the pace and came back on the end. I didn't watch it, but I believe he did something. That man did something. I, I don't know about Paris losing too many matches. He had to do something. He had something in his trunks or something. He kept the faith, brother, and he pulled out the win. We'll be right back with more NWA action after this. Where's the snack? Tonight, 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 NWA Worldwide.